Hello souls, how are you all doing? Hope you're all having a beautiful day. So, yes guys, this is going to be your daily reading for your person's energies. How are they thinking about you, their feelings towards you? When does this person want to come and why do they want to come to you? Okay, and I will be also like picking out cards about this person's energies, their feelings towards you and everything about this person. Okay, and also guys, if you are in a separation state, this reading will give you an overall clarity of when will this person come and um, like do they regret or everything about their energies for the day, right? okay my beautiful beautiful souls i i think we can start off with the reading for those of you who've been with me for all of your likes and comments i'm really happy to have you all here i mean you've just got me to a place where i just feel very proud of about myself and it's all because of you guys that have come to the place i am right now and i'm really thankful for all of your support all of your comments for all of your encouragement and yesterday's live was really lit i thank you so much for making that happen guys for those of you who've really supported me for guiding me thank you all so much it really means a lot and yes i've already announced my winners yesterday in my life and i've also like sent them a message in the comments saying that congratulations you won so for those of you who got that comment guys i will be uh, i will be texting you today okay so make sure to check your notifications if you get any notifications like viputa love divinations replied to you then please go check out because my details will be there for those of you who Actually, I told will give a personal reading. I will send you all my details so that you can contact me and I can give you a free reading, right? So, yes, guys, thank you so, so very much. And make sure to like and comment and subscribe to the channel to win a free reading for this week. So, at the end of the week on Sunday, when I come live, I will uh, say who and all won the free reading. And I will send you all my personal details, like my uh, email, so that I can send you a free reading. Or I'll send you my... Uh, whatsapp or maybe even my instagram so that i can um you can connect with me you can if you also wish to have a live free reading with me that is possible but all you have to do right now is make sure to like comment and subscribe to win a free reading from me guys but if you guys are in a very emergency situation right now, like if you cannot wait for the free reading till the end of the week, then make sure to go to my Fiverr account. You can book a reading with me there. And yes, let me just uh, start off uh, with your reading, guys. And the link of the Fiverr account is there in the description. So you can feel free to book a reading with me there. Let me start off with your general energies for the day and then we will be moving on to the love energies, right? Where is coming up? Wait a minute, guys. Let me just, okay, much better. Eight of Swords. I can see a lot of loyalty here. You're just going to be very loyal to those of you who feel are loyal to you. It's just a give and take policy. You're loyal to me. Let me be loyal. That is the uh, understanding that you're going to have with others. If they're not loyal, then they should never expect you to be loyal. With the Pisces energy popping up, I see that you're going to be very, very imaginative. A person who is running wild with imaginations. 
hand a person who really is very very sensitive so today can put you to a test where you get very easily emotional about certain things that you don't really have to be emotional about even the little things in life can make you really emotional and you might even think what is happening to me okay that kind of an energy but again the pisces energy is all about emotions imagination and also creativity so you might be starting to get more creative with yourself you might start to do something like a creative activity that you never done before or you never even thought of doing it before but right now you start doing it it's because of the pisces that is stepping in right so with the two of wands i can definitely see that you guys are not really sure with two things i mean uh if you go towards the right side the success will come to you if you go towards the left side success is going to come but you're still not sure which side to go you're still waiting to make a decision in your life i mean you're kind of confused about a decision that you have to make you know what's right but then you're still confused you're still in that thought process let me shuffle off camera guys we have the devil in reverse so that is very very good because you're stepping out of all of your addictions especially for those of you who have like a drug addiction or substance abuse like if you guys were really addicted to certain things you are coming out of these addictions it can even addictions doesn't really mean like alcohol and drug it can even mean as simple as like if you are waking up too late every day and it becomes like an addiction there is no proper routine that you're going through you will probably try to change that a little bit and try to bring back your old patterns right so that is the energy here let me pick out cards for your person's energies how they're feeling about you they're thinking what do they want from you and yes okay let me pick out cards for your person's energies guys and thank you so much for um joining me if you like this reading make sure to give it a thumbs up i will be moving on to your love energies now Vagos, what is coming up for your love energies Vagos, what is coming up Vagos? We have ownership. Detachment. Loyalty. Wow. So, Vagos, I can see here that this person is 100% loyal to you even if they feel detached. So, for a few of you, Vagos, this person is a little bit detached from you they're not texting you continuously they're not talking to you all the time or even like you had a separation so but this is like a unique case scenario over here because if somebody is very detached to someone it usually means like they're not interested or they don't love or something like that but with these cards i see that this person's detached from you but they're still loyal to you i mean they have they're very reliable and if you're thinking that this person is not nice to me they're not loving they're not caring to me that is totally wrong because Vagos, i can see here that this person may be detached from you. Maybe you are far away from each other. You feel like that detachment energy passing with this person. But again, you shouldn't forget this. They may be detached from you, but they're always loyal. They never even thought to cheat you or to do anything crazy to ruin the trust. I mean, this person has been loyal to you throughout, even though they are a little bit detached. The reason for the detachment is that childhood traumas or certain things that have happened in their past okay might have caused this trigger that they shouldn't get attached to someone too quickly or too much 
But at the same time, I definitely see that this person is very, very loyal. They're taking ownership of this relationship. I mean, they know that they were the one who initiated it. And they know that they need to keep manifesting you into their life. And they're kind of like very, very happy to have you in the in your in the life okay wago well, so if you feel detached from this person uh they still love you it's not like they don't care because i can see a lot of loyalty they're still talking about you to their friends they're very very expressive they're kind of like always talking about you they don't know what to do either than talk about you to everyone they meet everyone they see you are like the main topic that they always talk about okay so i don't know why this person keep on talking about you but maybe they're very jobless that makes them talk about you too much but yes Virgos, they're just talking about you too much that is what i can see here So bye Wago, see you all tomorrow, bye.